Titles by Fredericks of Hollywood. <laughs> Iowa State College, the high school after high school. Shelby's. I was boring until I got my Tony Pearl. If I could join the FFA, my life would be complete. I'd tell the soil, I'd bail some hay and make wow, some sound. Wow, quite a smell. hairdo on that gal in the middle. Hay probably can't remember the day or the date. All she remembers is that she was sitting in the study hall. With a loaded gun. Alice was really going to town on her physics assignment. Go, Alice, go! And Freck. Well, he was busy with his regular routine. Mm -hmm. It was just the usual sort of day. I think I'll get a tattoo. Or was it? She was eating cubes of mescaline There's jello. A bell for an assembly. Like Pavlov's dogs, they salivate at the sound of a bell. <laughs> this one was for the girls only. Oh. Nothing too unusual about that. The Chippendales were in town. <laughs> Kay found a seat. Her favorite, right next to the aisle. In case she barfs, she's got a tender tummy. Oh, that one. Your period and mine, mm -hmm. a lecture. Hmm? Hello, uh, am I on? Is this thing on? You want to look at that, Helen? Today, I'd like to tell you about several girls I know very well. And why I'm being fired. Now, I took several heavy ago, blows to the cheeks with a lead pipe. Ooh. Just as you are, what they would do after completing high school. <laughs> Let's start with Evelyn, who went on to college where she took a course in home economics. Now she's a tea room Hello, manager and thousands of people who eat out are her daily customers. You might see her talking to the hostess and never guess she's really the boss. Shut up, Grandma. You're lucky to have a job. Behind the scene, she's the one who makes the final check and adds that extra touch. Of salmonella. Ooh, wow. Kay thought she would like that sort of work. Kay was wrong. She could see herself at the center of a world made up of large ovens and, and large white-haired ladies. professional cooks. Gee, what would mom think of a grocery list like this? She'd laugh. For anyone with training in institution <laughs> management, though, it's just like planning the family. Yes, that's day. right. I said a full case of vodka. Then one day, Kay fiddled with accounts payable, took a long drive into the country, and got cabinet at the Bates and this Motel. this is Joanne. In high school, she always helped decorate for the parties. She liked it. She still decorates. For bozo. She has good pay now for doing it. An applied art major in home economics helped her develop this ability. <laughs> Kay couldn't resist daydreaming herself into this kind of job. Folks would look to her to help them make a wise choice. She would be asked to go out on appointments, to help people plan lovelier homes. Mm. Hmm. Ah, the swatches for the ponchos I ordered. The speaker told of other girls she knew, I real heard. girls in real jobs. Good jobs, interesting jobs, mm. well paid too. And everyone had taken her training in home economics. Including Chad. Some had specialized in foods and nutrition, others in education, mm. in yeah, textiles and clothing, household equipment. Hey, slow down! Child development, Rock our film. applied Rock art, about. institution what? management, <laughs> Save us. journalism. Home economics is all of this and more too. Damn. For instance, Carol, who is now Mrs. Bill Johnson, took a general home economics course. I don't want my Not wife working. Give me a beer. Professional <laughs> employment, but one which fitted her for that very important career of being Mrs. Johnson. Ooh. Kay's home would be like this. A dungeon. Hmm. Well, what the hell is that? Many times she was glad that her college training had prepared her so well for home life. How much did that cost? Well, bring it back. You must let me dress you. Can I have a few? Many too? times she didn't even realize that she was using some of the knowledge she had gained. And that her knowledge meant so much to her family. As That's well her husband as Jerry herself. with his new car. Escape. Escape. It wasn't hard for Alice to return to reality. She just went cold but turkey. As for Kay. Kate. Well, making a dream come true often depends on a very little thing. Window pane. Hmm, hmm let's see. 
Day after day, Ooh, she had passed by ourselves. that little book. The bell jar. Now oh, here it, it is. Suddenly Ghetto, the key Ghetto Freaks. There it is. Future. Of course, there were things she would have to do. Don't apply for girl. admission, study the courses, and... Drinking? Oh, yes. What would Mom and Dad say? Oh. Who knows? They only speak German. There was only one way to find out. Ask them. This was important. She realized that now, even before they said anything. You She's could tell loaded. that Mom and Dad knew that it was important, too. College for K would mean sacrifices for Human Mom and sacrifices. Dad. Ooh. Would it be worth the sacrifice? She consulted Robert McNamara. And Anne Rand. Do it, sis! Dear Dean Johnson, I couldn't really begin so this to... this was the important day in Kay's life. And it was late at night when she finally recopied the letter for I the last her time. at the touch of your... She got a real thrill out of dropping that letter in the box. <laughs> <laughs> now be cool, be cool, come on, be cool. Just, oh, it's good. Now let's get out of here. It's here already. Oh, shoot, I mailed it to myself. Hmm. Waiting for a reply was harder. Everybody it's from Ed McMahon. It says I already may be a winner. She had months to go, but she just couldn't wait to get out of that stifling home life. Dear, why are you packing your father's things? So this is college. So this is Pine Later, City we'll Votech. Have a homey look. Now it was a bit bewildering. Mm. Wonder where the tennis courts are. Where would her room be? Who would be her friends? Who would be her blood enemies? Wonder if she'd ever know her way around. What secret here. societies would she join? Wonder what her would she smoke like. thin black cigarettes and reject the triune god? Well, here's the dorm mother, affectionately known as Horseface. You lost the draw. You'll be rooming with the Ice Queen. At first, it looks bare and not very friendly. Who, her roommate? Ooh. Hmm, smells like high-grade weed in here. Well, we'll make a loft out of some railroad ties under the bed, a special export light in the window, and a... But with new curtains and bedspread, it doesn't take long to give it a homey feeling and a bit of college atmosphere. I've got a feeling Mom majored in home economics at Iowa State. <laughs> Before you know it, it's time for the folks to leave. <sighs> in all her dreams about song. college, Kay had never included the moment when Dad and Mom said goodbye, when she would be... On her own. Yeah, I'll see you in four years. Don't call. A friend always loved that. Thank God there was no physical contact. Mm -hmm. Mom, Dad, no, no. Well, well, just leave then. Forget you. I never loved you. Oh. <laughs> Poor kid. Now she'll race down to the Jean Luc Godard Festival at the campus theater. I'm so alone, I don't know what to do. I look at you and I go out of focus. Why does she have a picture of John Carradine in her nightstand? Mm. Oh, well, that's mom. That's mom. Oh, will you ever accept my Marxist yeah, ways? Arrived just when she did. Oh, hi, they how you like doing? We're gonna have a great time. We're gonna be pals. Yeah, the usual things. <laughs> and while they were talking... Two of the ripest tomatoes in town strolled in. Hi, uh, you get a bond? <laughs> Four girls, Kay and Jean, Helen and Louise. The group. For the next four years, they will see a lot of each other. <laughs> Come on, they just met. <laughs> Most of their experiences will be shared with each other. Kegs will be tapped, men will be used. They're strangely drawn to this that mystic first fountain. stroll with its first impressions. Thank goodness for head and shoulders. They stopped at the same places. Three coins and a fountain. They looked at the same scenes. They did the same things that many had done before. There Here was is a college sameness. with its new friendships, its old traditions. By the end of freshman week, they'd begun to feel that this college was their very own. Yeah, and they started by taking over the administration building. Off the pigs, off the pigs. How do you solve the problem like a college girl? Early October, Headed for an 8 o'clock class in Home Ec Hall. Tragedy struck. Just a lone gunman. <laughs> the Here's a young Judy a Chicago. Hey. It helped to build up a knowledge of the beauty Don't of design sit down. and color. <laughs> Surprising how everyone can make such interesting, original designs. While Kay struggles with basic motor skills. Mm. 
And the study of design and color wasn't all theory. Jean and Helen learned to apply it in their class on costume design and selection. Is that a real poncho or a Sears poncho? Oh, watch those huskies. All the classes seemed to fit together. I love this one. Even watch the this. physics class was what a girl would what's like. What's up? Come in here. I need you. It was about <laughs> physics in the home. This course helps you to understand just what makes things run. Then in household equipment, you could study the practical side. The use of an appliance. Uh, being treated like uh, an appliance. In turn, there were courses in foods and nutrition where you also learned the why. This is phlegm. Hey, it's the Woodstock of the 50s. Victor Bones on next. Play whip and post. Woo! afternoon. Football time. I'm a Q-tip. What are you? You were there with all the spirit you had spelling? for your high school team look, and look, many a little look, look at my crotch! Look! Look! Look at my crotch! Look at my crotch! Look at my crotch! Look! Look! Look at my crotch! Look! Look at my crotch! And afterwards, you met the game. And you really got slammed and apologized all day Monday. Hey, there's Neil Cassidy. I didn't know he went to college. Only for tricks. Hiya, Tank. That's off to Ray, Later, the whimsical lampshade. <laughs> after such an occasion, the girls got together for their usual gab session. For a time, they talked of the events of the day. But then Kay came up with that all-important question. Hey. How do Pop-Tarts work? What are you going to major in, Helen? Oh, you know me. Best cook to come out of Foods 204. I'm going to take foods and nutrition. Really, I am. Yeah, and I'm gonna I marry want a to be a dietitian. Yeah, right, you're going to be a short order cook for truckers in two years. Wish I could make up my mind that easy. What are you going to take, Jean? I'm going to take Bob for Pepper everything he's got. <laughs> I like to work with fabrics, beautiful clothes. Hey, look, it's Lou Costello and drag. Department stores. I'd like to go along with you, but I don't know yet whether I want to work for a household appliance company. Or, or where they're going with my artwork. Oh, these are the kind of problems you'll want to have. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to teach. Because I can't do it. Kay went to chat with her advisor. She learned about you a world what? of opportunities, things she'd never thought of before. Teaching. Listen to the flowers. Yes, it was a big profession. Sweet secrets. High school Love teaching. Love nursery school work for those who like very small children. And for medium sized kids, go and to a middle school. Teaching with farm do. families. Would teaching be her career? Or would it be the business world with its glamorous commercial jobs? And low-paying temp jobs. Mm -hmm. Would it be the public service field, perhaps a hospital dietitian? Mm -hmm. Or research with its look to the future? Academia. Yes, there would be all sorts of interesting huh? careers and best Hey, of look, all, it's Prince. You made a home of your own. <laughs> That's his real badness when he was still a chubby little white kid. See him up there? In purple? Oh, mm-hmm. That's a reach. <laughs> Sorry. College That's a reach. College is a timeless period. One year passes into another very quickly. Soon you die. It's good to be back. The At the beginning of it's your nice junior though. year, things seem pretty much the same. But this is the year... The National Guardsmen were on campus. ...in your chosen field. Helen, learning to be a hospital dietitian, must be able to plan and serve inviting meals. Plenty of butter. Pile it on. Plan good hospital well enough food. to fit a doctor's orders and serve them attractively oh, to... Oh, please pep don't eat the daisies. Appetites. Mm, square egg. She'll also have the problem of feeding large numbers of people. And her fat brother-in-law. That calls for quantity cookery, so you'll find her in classes in institution management. For quality cookery, use the Makery Bakery. Hmm. Louise, who has her eye on a commercial career in household equipment, is rapidly becoming a technician in her own field. Wiring bombs. The technical comparisons which she is making now are completely off to base. First-hand advice on the selection of home appliances. Her knowledge of efficient operation will be passed along. She could never be an engineer. Don't make me laugh. Huh. Now cough. Jean was just as busy in textiles and clothing. Oh, a very attractive awning. The world of fabrics and of fashions will be hers. Here she designs pants for Chuckles the Clown. Perhaps she will be designing the clothing you see pictured in fashion magazines. Oh, I don't know. Perhaps she'll be the person who has thought up the patterns you will buy at the store. Mm, it's possible. Perhaps Doubtful. she will show you how you can create beautiful clothes for yourself. Or help you choose them at the store. Oh, hi, Opal. Jane may even find another use for her talents. 
by combining her knowledge of art and textiles. She makes tar she heroin. She may follow a career in textile designing. Let's face it, Jean would do anything for a buck. Mm -hmm. The days are filled with other interesting classes, too. You would expect to find Kay with her interest in teaching. I'm getting lightheaded. Keep class. going. But Jean is there, too. To right. study children's clothing requirements? Well, yes. But more than that, Ouch. home economics means much what? more than a career. What? We have to be subjugated to men? It's a study of everything that makes up a home, including those who live there. The girls learn a lot from the children. Are the kids school. learning anything? All habits and attitudes learned at this age are so important uh, in later it's life. It's too tight. Oh, they it's learn too tight. It depends on it's calamari. With mm. For after all, we live in a world where people are more important than things. Oh, I don't know. Yes, college is a it rich variety on the of wall. experiences. Where? Over there. You tell mom and dad about the little events. One little boy is just darling. I really like that class. And keep the important stuff to yourself. And the big ones, too. Oh. Tonight is the big prom. I'm wearing... Everyone will die! I will dump pig's blood on Carrie! You know, she's gonna look like an unmade bed in that dress. Each good time that you had, mingled with the memories of other good times. And makes a delicious gravy. You'll never forget them. They were the glittering threads woven through the varied pattern of college life. Ooh, Here, a little sample of each of her victims. There's Bob, and Carl, and Steve. Being a senior wasn't much different from being a junior. Student teaching was in line for Kay. But Kay was out of line with student teaching. And Jean was busier than ever in her advanced courses in textiles mm. and clothing. She hasn't left this room in years. Helen was deep in studies on food buymanship. Getting her Grocery money shopping. worth, that is. Oh. One of the many things she will be doing next year in her well, let's job. Let's see, 30 grams to an ounce and... Hey, is this raw or refined? And Sugar. Louise, wouldn't you know she'd be in a household equipment laboratory? No, don't give up! Home Economics, starring Ephraim Zimbalist, Jr. What is Home Economics? Well, you think they would have told us by now. Yeah. Is it the technical knowledge of the equipment in a home? I don't think so. Or the understanding of how to create beautiful clothes mm, and no, more attractive uh, No, homes? that's not it. Is it the skill to prepare an attractive, nourishing meal? Maybe. Or the ability to teach others these many things? Is it for all time, this feeling yes, of joy? Home Economics is all these and more, too. Hmm. To put it another way, each girl is hey, it's preparing Abby Road. for two careers. Boy, you're going to carry that one. One, her chosen specialty. The other is a career in homemaking. Here we come, walking, walking down, down the street. street. And so, as a special part of their training, the senior girls actually there are only share six the management seniors? of home. First of all, the girls met their advisor and decided how they were going to take turns at managing all the household tasks. Here, Carol Bly explains her principles. This was no make-believe situation. With eight hungry persons to feed, Jean would have to draw on the knowledge she gained in basic courses in foods and in equipment. She had to steal from every grocery store in town. Who's part of her hazing? As for planning an attractive meal... And Forget pretty it. Things, that should be easy for a girl with special talent in color and design. But no, not for this woman. Kay, too, would draw on her knowledge of household equipment and Kay the textiles the to take care of her turn in the laundry. Oh, no, you put the laundry in the composting toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Louise, for a few days, would have the most envied task in the house. Sooner or later, everything and anything you had learned in your home economics courses would prove useful. Oh, that's a good one. And then she said, you're soaking in it. <laughs> Let me call you, sweetheart. Life in the home management house is very homey. Somehow you wish it would never end. And some of the happenings you will never forget. <laughs> Don't open the box. <laughs> the five-pound party that Beth had to announce... Five-pound party? She had a big breakfast, didn't she? So. My goodness. 
It's a wonderful world when you're married, when you have a family. The days roll by, and even before school is out, you have a new topic of conversation. Hmm. Getting your first job through the placement office. Meeting with Helen Gurley Brown. Well, yes, Kay, the teacher placement office tells me they're getting requests every day. Gina, I think oh, this yeah. job in a She's department a quick change store artist. will be very interesting to you. Huzzah! The letter has just come in telling us that you've been accepted for your hospital internship. You'll be emptying bedpans soon. Yes, Bingo. Louise will be happy to accept the position. Hey, keep up. Graduation. Hot and saucy, Texas style. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mom and Dad were there, of course. They didn't say much, but you knew they were pleased. That's this key father. Dad left made early. some remark about he sure had earned his diploma. Ah, kind of Dad just doesn't that. get it. Gene and Louise were leaving at once for their jobs in the city. So you all drove down to the train to see them all. And to reenact the last scene from Anna Karenina. As you stood there on the platform, wishing each other the very best of good fortune. You know you didn't mean somehow it. Somehow the talk got around to that very Speaking of wishing meeting. farewell, let's roll. And oh, then you sensed that time. this was the end of one chapter in your life. Oh. Chapters, the editor's so wrote and spiced up a bit. Uh, I'm coming, I'm coming. Let's do a waffle. You wouldn't have missed. 